Let's reduce blue light so you can go to sleep faster on iPhone. At some point, you've probably heard somebody talk about the dangers of blue light before bed, looking at your phone, looking at computer screens, etc. Although it's possible that blue light contributes less than the stimulation we are getting from the content on those devices, it still has an impact. Blue light looks like the sun, not like candlelight. We don't think of the sun as blue, but it is a blue color of white light. Therefore, it tells our brains, no, 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 that whole melatonin to go to sleep thing, we don't need that because it's wake up time. In order to combat that, your iPhone has an option called night shift, but it's not always on by default. Some people don't think it's pretty. Okay, that's a personal choice, but if you wanna turn it on, here's how you do it. You open up the settings app and you go down to display and brightness. And here it is, night shift and you have the option of sunset to sunrise. You can pick a different schedule. For example, it says 10 p.m. to 7 a.m., okay. I prefer sunset to sunrise, although occasionally here in the summer because it gets dark so very late, I will sometimes have the night shift go on earlier, but sunrise to sunset's pretty safe. You can actually adjust it even further by making it more warm or less warm. For example, because I'm more likely to do reading on my iPad, I've had that set to more warm. So it's gonna turn a little bit more orange, which means less blue light. As an added bonus, you can also here turn on dark mode and you can have it be automatic sunrise to sunset. There you go. That's how you turn on night shift to lower blue light at night on iPhone.